because I have a friend who works at Walsall College and one of the subjects he teaches is plumbing. So he gets the students together and what he does, he teaches them plumbing, you know, when you want your house completely, uh, perhaps a new central hand heating system or perhaps a new sink in your kitchen or your bathroom, something like that where you've got your plumbing involved. And what he does from time to time after the students have started to learn these subjects is he gives them a little test. So what he's done on this occasion, he's asked the students to produce something which demonstrates the working of a plumbing in your bathroom. Right? So the students have to come up with a demonstration of that. And this is what one of the students came up with. And this is, this is what it is. <laughs> Uh, and, of course, my colleague said to the student who produced this, well, how does this represent the plumbing in the bathroom? And the student said, well, here we have the pipe, because you need a pipe, do you not, to carry the water to everything, and the taps this end represents the tap in your bath. And the one this end represents the taps in your wash-hand basin. And, of course, this end you have your... Plug. You need a plug, do you not, in order to stop the water running out when you have a bath. And of course you also need a plug the other end to stop the water running out when you wash your hands. And my colleague said, well, this is no good because this one might reach the bath, but what about this one? It's too short. Um, the student said, well, it doesn't matter because if you pull this, it, it's long enough now. I said, well, that's no good. What about this one is too short? And the student said, well, you're not likely to use the wash hand basin at the same time as you use the bath, but it doesn't matter because you can actually do that. Or you can do that, or you can do that, or you can still see that they are completely separate, and you can do that, and this one is separate. But he said, well, you can have them both like this, but they won't be long enough. And the student said, well, it doesn't really matter because what you can do, you can actually break them like this and you can actually take it apart. So they are separate like this. And this one is separate and is long enough. And this one is separate as two and it's long enough. And you can actually put the pipes back together again, like so. And then you're actually back to where you started from because you find that this one works on that one. <laughs> this one works on this one. And they are completely separate. It doesn't do. And my colleague was so impressed that he gave the student full marks. <laughs>